This is Lee's documentary of the Olympics, young people in the Olympics. So how do you think it appeals to the audience? Well, well I thought that he had many things that appeal to the audience because he used music that was <coughs> up and coming. It mainstream. was mainstream, everyone knows about it. I really think if you, heard it, if you heard it on the radio, if you just heard it in like the background, I think you would know who it was. He had people that actually are the same age yeah, and probably, around yeah. the same around 16 24 year olds yeah people yeah who, who he interviewed yeah and there was a range of eth ethnicities as well white yeah. black asian everyone is exactly Asian. so that was that was really good example yes yeah. and also because it's a new topic so yeah. more people are going to want to know more about it so. yeah. uh yeah sports obviously all trust. Mm. Yeah. Interest, yeah. Anyway, but it also had girls in there, so that made it appealing to the girls' side as well, yeah. instead of just making it to a boys' yeah. side. And also, the Olympics appeals to everyone, so it doesn't really. Yeah, so it appeals yeah. to everyone. Yeah. It was a lot like a sports documentary. Yeah. Mm. So, what do you think is USP? Is? <coughs> unique selling point. Uh, it's relevance, really, isn't it? Just I don't really it. think there was a unique selling point there, I don't know. I yeah, think, that's obviously, that's the Olympics is around the corner. Yeah, yeah. that's what I'm saying. That's, that's yeah. it's, it's so relevant now. It won't be in a year. Because that's what I'm saying. I think interested. everyone, if yeah. that was on the actual TV, I think everyone would watch it because they'll yes. be interested in Build how up. the Olympics is, what, what it's doing to young gamers yeah. and stuff. So I think that's what makes it special. Makes it unique. In its own, in its own way, yeah. yeah. So, so but can you see a place in the market for it? I don't know. It's, it's mainstream, isn't it? Yeah. So yeah I can see it. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. The BBC. There's going to be loads of stuff going on about yeah. the Olympics. <laughs> Yeah. It, would be, it would be something like BBC One, but obviously this will be BBC Three, so it'll probably be on. It'll be on any BBC channel. Yeah, yeah. any BBC channel. Obviously, everyone would watch it. I think. Yeah, yeah. Would watch it. People can relate to it. Yeah, because well. it's in London, so obviously yeah. this thing then it's in Stratford, around the corner. You know. Yeah. Conventions. Uh, what conventions um, were in there? He used different music. Yeah. which made it yeah. effective, yeah. different types, and the graphics as well, the backgrounds, yeah. interviews. Yeah, the interviews, yeah, I like, I like the change of voiceovers with everyone. Yeah, like uh, that, that, was, that, was, that was effective, that was the cool. voiceovers, yeah. yeah, that was effective. You had sign on, sign on, yeah. sign on, sign on, sign on. comedy, yeah, entertained, it and educated. Entertained. It, it was quite funny, certain bits were obviously the, the connect, the, the connect one. Do you think it fulfills the ethos? Inform, entertain. Yeah, yeah. Did. I think I think they were free. I think I think it did inform us. Informed yeah. us how young gay makers can actually take part, or if they how how it makes them like yeah, if, yeah. They didn't, if they didn't take part or not. How yeah. you can actually participate with the Olympics if you don't even go to it. Yeah. Uh, entertains obviously. Is it a montage? Yeah, yeah. the beginning. Oh, oh yeah, when the uh, yeah. music started. And, and the they showed the guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They showed the guy there. <laughs> okay, cool. Um, yeah. Interviews were used. Good um, um, use titles. Use technology. The, 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 yeah, the, the good, the, the good shot. Yeah, yeah. 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 Well, the the shots were effective, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, that, when he was walking, yeah, and it, and it sped, sped up, up and, then, yeah, and it was yeah, good yeah. effect. Effects. It worked. Um, it worked well. All the interviews were side angle. None of them were looking at the camera. Yeah, but he used a bright shot as well. He used point of view. He used one when he was playing football, and then he used like long, yeah, the long, of yeah, shots, yeah, the range which made it effective because you don't want to be just sitting there bored, a bored watching just one shot. Yeah, um, and the music was yeah, graphics, graphics, yeah, music yeah. was really good. I don't graphics. think it would have been better. Graphics could, could yeah, have, graphics, could have been a bit one improvement in graphics could have been better, obviously. Mm. They were a bit plain. A bit plain. obviously because of his time constraint. Yeah. He couldn't, he couldn't transfer it to Final Cut, so he couldn't really. Yeah, yeah he couldn't. Yeah. Well, time was an issue there, but. I mean, if he had more time, I think yeah. he would have done that. Yeah. Um, improvements. Um, so we talked about editing. We do fast editing. Oh, yeah, editing. Um, yeah, he's good editing. I mean, I think he could have used a more variety of editing instead of just using. Instead of putting, just like, instead of putting in more transitions, you mean? Yeah, yeah, more transitions. Instead of putting like a picture of it, you could have maybe like overlapped or fading or fade out something. Right? Yeah. And yeah. I think at the beginning, where that that music came in, yeah, he should have let the beat drop. Yeah, it would have been wicked. Earthquake. I think it should have gone. <laughs> 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 
And the camera language, I think there could have been more shots, slower and yeah. more higher and stuff. Improvements, though. Uh, improvements. Uh, I thought there was a shot where he could have, where he was interviewing the. That one of the. Mayor of London. He's Where's Chris Cummins, when he's interviewing him, there's a big space on the bottom of his head. Of thirds, yeah. Which oh, yeah. he could maybe. He, I think that's where he's gonna. If he had more time, he could have yeah, put yeah. a final cut and yeah. edited it. But even then, he should have maybe like you know, done it properly mm. instead of rushed. Mm. The sound level's been a bit worked. It's yeah. like really high, and then yeah, it, it starts off at the beginning of the and then it just goes low, and some of the voiceovers and more cutaways as well during the interviews. I don't think there was. There wasn't really many cutaways. There was, there was a, no, was he only had, really had cutaways at the start of it, but then uh, during when he interviewed the PE yeah. teacher, I think, then it was a bit, it got a bit dry, you saw, like, yeah. near the end, and yeah, he could have had maybe just, maybe put in one or two. Yeah, that dragged away, so he should have, yeah. Uh, the facts didn't stay on for too long. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he could have, yeah, he could have put the facts on for much longer, like maybe more than five seconds, maybe six seconds. Just, just so you can read them, because I didn't really, I didn't really catch them. Um, talked about graphics. Yeah. Maybe the box box could have been the same angle for every person, instead of one person having a, like a close up on one person, you know, you can see off his Yeah, body. on the side of it. Yeah. Yeah, like, yeah that's true, you know, that is very true. Yeah, yeah pop no. Overall, it's good. Yeah, it's good. Good work, Lee. Good work. <laughs> 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 <laughs>